The Notes app just got a quiet but meaningful upgrade with a smarter UI layout, improved formatting tools, a cleaner share sheet, and even Markdown export built right in. In iOS 26, Apple didn't go for flashy redesigns. They focused on subtle but powerful improvements that change how you capture, organize, and share ideas. Here's what's new and what you can expect when iOS 26 officially rolls out this September. Let's take a closer look. First, UI overhaul, folders and navigation. Open up notes in iOS 26, and the first thing you'll notice is a more modern, user-friendly interface. The note count is now clearly displayed right under each folder name, larger, more readable, and easier to spot at a glance. The search bar has moved to the bottom of the screen. On larger iPhones, this change makes it far more ergonomic, especially when using one hand. The Compose button has also been repositioned for better thumb reach, making it faster to start a new note without stretching. At the top, you'll find new controls for managing folders and filtering notes, making navigation feel more streamlined and responsive. These tweaks might seem small, but they significantly improve the daily flow of using notes. Second, note editing experience, toolbar, and formatting. Now, open any individual note, and you'll see even more changes. The old yellow toolbar? It's gone. It's been replaced by a floating tab bar that feels cleaner and more modern. When you tap into your text, the formatting toolbar now horizontally scrolls instead of abruptly cutting off. This means all your formatting options, like checklists, tables, titles, and styles, are always within reach. The familiar AA formatting icon still works, but those tools are now also integrated into the main floating bar, so there's less jumping between menus. In short, editing feels smoother, faster, and more predictable. Third, sharing and exporting, new share sheet and markdown. When you hit the share button, a redesigned animation slides in from the top, featuring rounded icons and a cleaner layout that matches the rest of iOS 26. But the real upgrade? You can now export notes as Markdown. This is huge for developers, bloggers, and anyone who prefers clean, portable formatting. Let me show you a simple example. Say your note looks like this. Shopping list, apples, bananas, milk. When exported as Markdown, it becomes like that. It's lightweight, universally compatible, and ready to paste into any Markdown-based app, blog post, or document. Fourth, Safari integration, shortcuts and note creation. Apple has also deepened notes integration with Safari. Tap the three-dot menu in Safari, then choose Share. You'll now see four new options related to notes. Create note, instantly sends the current web page to notes. Create quick link, saves just the URL with a title. Create snippet, lets you save a selected quote or section. Run script allows automation workflows to run right from the share sheet. This turns notes into a lightweight research and web capture tool and integrates cleanly with shortcuts, giving power users even more flexibility. Now that you've seen what's new in iOS 26, let's take a step back because to really appreciate where Apple Notes is today, you need to see how far it's come. From its humble beginnings to becoming a serious competitor to apps like Evernote and Notion, the journey of Apple Notes is full of surprises and a few hidden features you might've missed along the way. Here's the full story. Before the iPhone launched in 2007, there was already a Notes app, but most people never noticed it. It quietly lived inside Apple Mail on the Mac. Kind of like how Outlook today lets you jot down quick notes. No icon, no fanfare. Just a hidden tool for capturing ideas. So when notes appeared on the very the first notes. iPhone, the with that now iconic yellow legal pad there. design, it so wasn't actually search. new. It was the quiet continuation of something Apple had already started notes, building. A native space body. for your thoughts, sketches, and scribbles. One that felt natural, like a real notepad in your pocket. Over the years, it evolved from simple text to synced checklists, handwritten math, and even AI-powered writing. Today, we're unpacking the story behind Apple Notes, 
how it went from background utility to one of the most powerful understated tools in Apple's entire ecosystem. Notes launched on the iPhone in 2007 as a bare bones app, yellow line background, marker style font, and little else. There was no rich text, no checklists, and no syncing between devices. Even font choices were limited until iOS 4, when Helvetica and Chalkboard were added. Notes could only sync by connecting to an email account, which was clunky and unreliable. Despite its limitations, Notes was always there, fast, tactile, and simple. Competing apps like Evernote offered tagging and cloud sync, but Apple Notes was built in and instantly accessible. The real transformation began in 2013, when Notes became a standalone app on the Mac and gained iCloud support. This allowed for seamless syncing across iPhone, iPad, and Mac, making your notes available everywhere without manual setup. In 2015, iOS 9 brought a major overhaul. Checklists, drawing tools, document scanning, rich text formatting, and the ability to add attachments. Notes became more than a scratch pad. It could now handle project outlines, grocery lists, and sketches all in one place. By 2018, over 80% of iPhone users were using Notes every month. Apple even highlighted this at WWDC, showing just how essential Notes, notes had become. But here's the thing. Most people didn't even realize Notes could do more than just text. Features like file attachments and document scanning were quietly added, but many users only discovered them much later. That's not an accident. Apple's design philosophy for Notes has always been about just enough functionality, never clutter. As Craig Federighi once put it, people want to take Notes, not configure a workspace. So Notes stayed clean and simple on the surface, but under the hood, it became much more powerful, thanks to iCloud. Where they came from. iCloud now, is the invisible great. engine on behind iPhone, Notes. It handles fast iPad, syncing, end-to-end -end encryption, and, and well. offline access. And all of your content is kept, kept up to date across all of your devices via iCloud. If you want to know more about how iCloud works and why it matters, check out my other video, iCloud Explained. From 2016 to 2019, Apple focused on power and organization. With iOS 10, Notes introduced real-time collaboration, letting multiple users edit a note at the same time. iOS 11 brought in tables, pin notes, a built-in document scanner, and Apple Pencil support for handwriting and sketches. Then with iOS 13, gallery view and shared folders arrived, making it much easier to organize and visualize your notes. Apple's approach always centered on clarity and simplicity. Even as Notes gained features like tables and checklists, they stayed easy to use, without the clutter you might find in more complex apps. Fast forward to 2020 through 2022, and Notes got even smarter and more connected. iOS 15 introduced tags, smart folders, and mentions for collaborators, making it easier to organize and manage shared notes. Quick note, let you jot down ideas from anywhere on your device. No need to open the app first. And with note-to-note -note linking, inspired by powerful knowledge management tools, connecting your ideas became effortless. If you've tried these features or have a favorite way to organize your notes, let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear how you use Apple Notes to stay productive. Now, from 2023 to 2025, Apple Notes has truly become a powerhouse. With iOS 18 and the latest updates, here are some of the most advanced features. Live audio transcription, lets you record audio right inside a note and automatically generate searchable transcripts. Math Notes allows you to write equations by hand and get instant solutions, perfect for students, teachers, or anyone working with numbers. On iPad, SmartScript uses on-device machine learning to refine your handwriting in real time, making it smoother and easier to read. Collapsible sections and highlighting help you organize long notes and emphasize key ideas. Enhanced security now lets you lock notes with Face ID and manage privacy with more detailed controls. These updates, combined with deep integration across all Apple devices, make Notes a serious competitor to apps like Notion, Evernote, and OneNote. 
especially if you're already invested in the Apple ecosystem. Some of these features, like math nodes or smart script, have multiple options or settings. If you want a detailed tutorial or have questions about how they work, drop a comment below. I'm happy to help. And if you're finding this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe. It really helps the channel and lets you stay updated on the latest Apple tips and tricks. In conclusion, what started as a simple yellow notepad has evolved into a synced, searchable, and secure extension of your mind. Apple Notes now supports everything from quick thoughts to complex projects, blending simplicity with powerful tools and privacy. So open the app, write a thought, link your ideas, and rediscover the most powerful tool already on your iPhone. Apple Notes, your ideas, organized, everywhere, and always evolving.